Quite a few times I found myself this morning into this afternoon looking up and saying, wow, what a beautiful day. And it was low humidity. Uh, temperatures, of course, cooler than they have been, but not terrible out there. We made it up to 69 degrees uh, right around where we should be this time of the year. Now we're back to 60 degrees and about to get cooler as we head into tonight and tomorrow morning. Let's go ahead and take a look at your neighborhood temperature right now, dropping into the 50s already in spots across northern Trumbull County. That's where more clouds have been drifting in this afternoon. Uh, down to the south where the sunshine is, it's much warmer. Uh, 73 in Salem right now, 66 in Austin Town. And uh, the clouds that I was talking about, well, they're working their way southward. You can split them along I-76 here and then Interstate 80 into Mercer County. Uh, points northward, more clouds, but these will drift southward across Mahoning and Columbiana County tonight, and it's probably a good thing because if the clouds weren't moving in, we would get much cooler as we go into tomorrow morning. We're already going to get cool enough. Let's see how cold. 7 o'clock this evening, temperature still in the 50s, clouds around uh, right into early morning, more clouds overnight. Uh, by first thing in the morning, spots to the north of Trumbull County and Mercer County upper 30s, around 40 degrees in spots, uh, southern Trumbull and Mercer County, and a little bit warmer into the middle 40s across Columbiana County by first thing tomorrow morning. The clouds will stick around for a while tomorrow, and then the sunshine breaks out at least through midday, and we'll get our break, and that sun will help uh, warm temperatures up a little. We're only going to climb into the upper 50s to around 60 in spots, and then the clouds move back in tomorrow night. Now, as we head toward early Thursday morning, there's a small chance uh, for a sprinkle or an isolated shower, just a very small chance at that. There's still a lot of dry air in place, and that means more sunshine for Thursday, and temperatures warm up even more so, and that'll be a trend into the weekend. 40 tonight, watch for some patchy fog, the clouds increasing, and of course, the cooler temperatures around. Uh, tomorrow, highs in the upper 50s, much cooler. A uh, few clouds around in the morning, then some sun, then a few more clouds into tomorrow evening and tomorrow night. A pollen tracker, oh, it stays high. Grass, ash, mulberry, and oak, your main pollen concerns uh, through the day tomorrow. And let's go ahead and talk about that seven-day forecast. Well, temperatures stay cool, at least for a few days, 41 Thursday morning, but back in the low 60s, not only Thursday, but Friday. Friday night, if we clear out, we could dip into the upper 30s, and there's a small chance if enough cold air comes in for a little bit of light frost. Going to keep an eye on that. Saturday looking nice. Sunday looks better than it did yesterday. Highs in the mid 70s, but showers and thunderstorms return. We're just in time for Memorial Day. Unsettled weather with stormy weather early next week. And speaking of 